how it it how to affect a cultural shift in a lot of different areas within museums and the answer tends to be the same whether it's social media or open content um, we have for many many years found our most successful colleagues um, doing what we've called for a long time skunk works um, small projects prototype projects projects that are done um, out of the back pocket of you know of staff members who are interested in trying something new, um, projects that are sometimes not authorized um, by, by senior management. I have been advocating for a little while that we need, to, we need to stop doing those projects and begin to think about changing the culture um, of, of participation from the top down, getting, getting executives, um, senior staff, um, and in fact everybody within an organization on board. I think that there is um, the risk with projects that, that, are, that are done on the cheap, on the fly, and, and in a way that is not authorized, um, of failure that, that then taints all other such projects. Mm. And so um, I think that, that these are policy questions. And, um, I have long for a long time thought that we need to make our policies and our practices mesh. I think there is a generational factor to this. And I think that's a shift where the people who are typically in control of a museum, um, in terms of directors and uh, senior managers, have to learn and be uh, and listen from the junior members of the staff in terms of what um, what works and what doesn't, and what washes and what doesn't, in a sense, um, in the social media stream. Because if, if people aren't practitioners themselves and aren't participants themselves, they need to be connecting with people who are. And that's not just high-priced consultants on the outside. It's the people who, on their staff, who are committed to that institution, who love the institution. That's why they came to work there, probably at nonprofit wages that aren't very good. It might be just doing coat check or taking tickets or something like that. But they're probably committed to the subject matter, and they probably have a social media life. And this is an opportunity for these people who might not even know each other's names. I mean, the, the, the directors and the senior managers might not know the names of the people who are taking, co taking coats or sitting or in the atrium or in the, you know, the ticket booth or whatever. It's time for them to meet and, 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 for, and for them to listen. You need to spread this beyond the uh, di digital or web or, I, or the IT team and also beyond the marketing team. It has to be, it has to start in, a, in, uh, in one of those places and then spread out outwards across the organisation and it needs to have buy-in at the senior, senior levels. Maybe, uh, maybe not straight away, but it needs to move towards uh, that. It needs to build enough mo uh, momentum to get that buy-in.